Good afternoon and welcome to the 2020 CIAA post-game press conference. I am Cassandra Price, Assistant Athletic Director for Sports Communications at Virginia State University. Today we are joined here by Head Coach Swan of Bowie State University. Coach, can you please introduce your players and give us a brief update of the game? Um, sophomore Drew Calhoun and senior Sean Kier McCollum. Sorry, my voice is kind of gone. <laughs> um, it was it was a great game. I'm very excited about our um, team win. It was a team effort. Um, I'm glad that today I don't have to come in here and talk about our slow start um, because I feel like we came out with a lot of energy. Um, we stayed composed. We had a little a little bit of moments where we lost ourselves, but we were able to execute on offense, play great defense, and rebound. I think those were the keys to our success today. We will now open the floor for questions. Please state your media affiliation and proceed with your question. Evan Johnson, Bowie State University Television. Coach Swan, it's been a historic 24 plus hours for you. Yesterday you win your 100th game. Today your team wins their 25th game of the season. Has it all set in for you yet? Um, not really. I think uh, it'll all set in once we win the championship. I mean, that's our main focus, the 100 wins, the 25 wins. To me, none of that really matters if we don't win the championship. Uh, I would say this is the best feeling ever, but I know that it's not, we're not done yet. I just know that we have one more game to win the championship, and that's what we would do. I'm not happy until we win the championship. Greg wins with BSU TV. This question is for Coach Swan. Coach, after losing to this very same team a few years ago in the championship game, how does it feel now to be on the opposite side looking again at going for the championship? Um, I just, I mean, Two years ago is two years ago. You know, we really don't um, focus on that. We just know that we have to come in tomorrow and play our best. Um, it's a completely different team than two years ago, um, completely different style on both ends. So we have to come in and put our best foot forward. Um, we have a, the four, four players from that year, so they know the feeling, and they've been telling their teammates, look, you don't want to go to the championship and not win. Um, so I think that they're doing a good job of encouraging each other and staying positive and just motivating each other to come out and play tomorrow. On the eighth, Zach Collins, what's that for Prince George Community TV? Coach, what do you say to your team when they got it down to like a seven point, six point lead and you know you had the whole fourth quarter to play? Mm -hmm. What was your strategy then? Um, get stops on defense. Keep, keep your composure and just continue to get stops. Um, we know that if we're able to get stops, our offense will flow eventually, but we're a defensive team, defensive-minded team. So it was just one stop at a time. So just continue to get stops. Even when we turn the ball over, miss shots, don't allow them to score. So just play defense. Last question. We're Manning over Las Vegas University Um, Drew, you hit two big threes back to back there. I believe took you off the double uh, took you ahead by double digits and look like that was the momentum changer. Um, talk about taking those two shots and what that did to up your team. Um, well, technically I'm the shooter on the team, so they needed me to hit a hit a big shot, so that's what I did. And whatever my team needs, that's what I'm gonna do. And those two shots just came in the clutch time. Coach, student athletes, good luck tomorrow. Thank you. This concludes our press conference. Thank, Thank you. you.